So much for sneaking around. I'm not here, dude. Just move on. There's another one here somewhere, but uh... oh, that was too much. Your weapon parts I lady I know that look You've got all the parts haven't you Here you go Yes Outstanding I only need a few minutes to finish the prototype I'll take the version that won't blow my arms off Thanks Hi So did you blow up any machines to get the parts Or any bandits You Really like explosions, huh? <laughs> Here we go. With the boomsticks? Oh, you betcha. Um, is it safe? Probably. Can I have one? No. Ah. Oh. Cause we're gonna make you something even better. The boom. Boom. Backthrow is launched powerful project has that can hit enemies at long range. Due to their long build up, they have a slow rate of fire and cannot be used by jumping or crouching. Its max must be thrown at full draw in order to penetrate armor. If your inventory is full of items, you gather we go to your stash. You can retrieve items from the stash of settlements or shatters around the world. Okay. Let's get all the quests. Uh, savior, <laughs> tell me, are you seeking passage into no man's land by any chance? Maybe. Why do you ask? Ah, well, to hammer it plain, there's treasure out west. Unclaimed scrap and ancient metal. And I've got a sturdy band of salvagers that knows the lay of the land. You're not afraid of the Tanakh? <laughs> Terrified. But I carry out most of my business in no man's land. A neutral territory and all that. Barren Light is our port of entry. When its doors aren't closed for an embassy. <laughs> I was hoping your arrival meant they might be opening soon. I've got a business to run, after all. I want that embassy to happen as much as you do. Believe me, I'm working on it. <laughs> Good to know. And uh, keep us in mind. If you do uh, manage okay. to open the way, our main camp will be just past Baron Light. We'll buy any scrap you've got on you. And if you're looking for machine parts, we've got the best in the West, guaranteed. All right. Maybe later then. Uh, if you can get those blasted gates open. <laughs> I'm sure I will. Guess I'm not the only one who wants to get those gates open. Yeah. Cleared out the machines. I think you have some Hey. What are you doing? Hey. What happened here? What do what do you care? Don't you? As it happens? No. You know, I was already having a crappy day, and now these these two idiots picked my shift to climb the damn mountain. Wouldn't be so bad if this one weren't so heavy. Wait. Two idiots? Did I stutter? Yeah, two. I heard another hey. one shouting up top. Sounds like they got caught between sharp claws and a sharper fall. Someone's in trouble. Uh, aren't you gonna do something? <laughs> Self-inflicted. And I got my hands full with this one. You're seriously Very helpful, not going soldiers. To you seriously are. <sighs> oh boy, what an Someone's attitude! At the top of the cliff. You 
good idea. Hi, you know. Yes, yes, I'm just collecting stuff. <laughs> I don't know what you're talking about. Come now. Let me thank you. Are you hurt? I live. My so called bodyguard. You see him on your way up? He's yeah, he was dead. Hard to miss him. He's dead. Oh. Guess that's what I get for believing in the first chuff in the tavern who said he was a, a mountain climbing machine hunter. Ugh, at least I don't have to pay him now. What are you doing up here? That used to be a signal tower. The mechanism uses a special lens which in some very specific circles is highly valuable. And since the Karja are planning on tearing them down, I was going to... Liberate the lens before it got destroyed. You get it for me, and the lens is from the other towers. I'll make it very worth your while. I already found some, actually. <laughs> well, look at that. Looks like you're quite the opportunist too, eh? Let me take these off your hands then. This should be a nice reward for your efforts. I'm an uh, honest merchant, money. after all. Thank you, Aloy. Reyna. Well, Aloy, as soon as I'm up for it, I'll be going back to Baron Light to rest this ankle. But I'll stick around in case you want to get me that lens up this tower here. No pressure. Just saying. I mean, I will get it, it since I'm here already. I'll see what I can do. Mm. Wait, which button do I have to hold down? Both of them? Okay. Yes, apparently. Nice way in. Okay. I'm in. Oh my god, I want to collect not jump around. Not leaving anything behind. Oh, I love the music. Better look up the playlist for this game too. It's no good. Can't use the tester on that. This place. Yes. <laughs> Not 
do need to go higher, I think. If we go there. That way, maybe? Jump. Oh, there are more stuff down there that I miss. Okay. I uh, don't think that this is the way. My climb up. No. What about here? No. I'm blind. One of the signal devices. Should be a lens I can grab for Reyna. <gasps> what the fuck, Aloy? What is wrong with you? Uh, how do I... It's like she's doing things by herself, like these jumpy stuff. We've got the lens. I can trade it with Reyna the next time I see her. Yeah, I'm good. You scared me there. The chip, but instead, Elo diving head first into the ground below her is giving me anxiety, right? I'm like, girl, what the hell are you doing? This is not what I asked you to do. Why are you trying to kill yourself? I drop down here, yes. Hi, Did Liv. you find the lens? How are you? Maybe. If you're ready to trade. Ha! Let's deal. Here you go. Isn't that a sight? And here's a little something for your troubles. Now, if you find any more of these, make sure to come find me at Baron Light. You got All it. right. See you around. Ignoring. Where's Aaron? Looks like he's had a few. Ignoring yes, me yes. Again. Maybe a talk. Take this quest. Savior. You're my last hope. Conover. She's Meridian's savior, not yours. It's just I can be his. Aloy. What do you want? Please, no one will listen. But the eclipse. They're here in the daunt. Really, Conover? Aloy's the one that defeated them. You're bothering her with this hogwash now? Some of them must have fled west after the battle at the Alight. I saw one of our sentries, Lorovic, sneaking off to meet with one. I tried to eavesdrop, but they spotted me. And then Lorovic tried to kill me. I... <laughs> fought back. It was him or me. Unfortunately, there's no hard evidence that connects Lorovic to the Eclipse. And since Conover doesn't deny killing his fellow soldier, Nozar sentenced him to death. What makes you so sure Lorovic was working with the Eclipse? Well, I was too far to hear everything. 
but I heard them both say the word eclipse. It's not the most outlandish claim I've heard, but it's up there. Crying eclipse is a convenient way to dodge a death sentence. If I have to die, so be it. But if we ignore this threat, others are going to die too. Okay, let's hear you, Mel. exactly what happened. Weeks ago, during a shift change, mm -hmm. some trespassers slipped through the gate. By the time anyone noticed, they were halfway out the canyon. Nozar didn't see the need to give chase. Let the Tanakh take care of them, he said. Nozar's not one to be sidetracked. He tightened up the patrol schedules, reprimanded the sentries, and everyone moved on. But I couldn't stop thinking about it. None of us are careless out here, meaning someone left it open on purpose. And Larovic, well, he's always grumbling about officers. But on this, he was too quiet. And after the incident, he started acting different, jumpy. So when I spotted him sneaking out of the barracks after hours, I followed. I found him arguing with a stranger. And when Larovic mentioned the eclipse, I, I tried getting closer, but they heard me. The stranger took off, and Larovic lunged at me with his knife. Instincts took over. Sentries heard the scuffle and found me standing over his body. I believe him. Why don't you believe him? We combed the woods, searched Larovic's bunk, searched it again, didn't find anything. Look. He was a good bug. I heard, a good uh, man. Peasant, I and I wanted to see if I can find it because it sounded pretty but close, but no luck. Listens to facts. My favorite dog did start chasing Conover something, though, so I wonder if it's the peasant or something else. No, but what is a peasant? And considering there. there's no evidence backing up this eclipse story, Let me go well, on. we can't question a dead man. Nozar's on edge with the upcoming embassy and doesn't want distractions. But hey, if you find a bunch of Eclipse soldiers hatching an evil plot in the woods, please do let us know. I see. I see. The meeting you witnessed. Did you <laughs> hear anything else about their plans? No. But the clearing where they met is just east of here, across the river. A dozen soldiers have already searched at Conover. There's nothing there. I can see things others can't. If the Eclipse are in the Daunt, I'll find them. Thank you, Aloy. Sun bless your search. Don't get your hopes up, soldier. Hey, we definitely gonna do that quest. Let's talk with Aaron, though. Slow down! She must be in a hurry. Gentlemen. That's our cue. You taking the edge off? Huh. Well, I mean, I'd ask you to join, but... Who'd be left to save the world, right? <clears throat> All right, now let me guess. You're in a rush, right? So, uh, whatever you need. Ask away. How have things been since I... Your silent departure? <laughs> yeah, not bad. Vanguard's going strong. Help the Vod pick up the pieces after the battle with the Eclipse. And I took a month to bury Ursa in the claim. Well, when I got back, I got the assignment to babysit Wadis on his way to the embassy. I thought that'd be a cakewalk, so of course things went sideways. You got blindsided. It wasn't your fault. <laughs> Up more of these, maybe I'll believe you. I was, um, wondering if you were able to lay Ursa to rest like you wanted. Uh, yeah, 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 we did. Uh, just seen the crowd that showed up to pay their respects. Half of them owed her a favor, and the other half, the other half owed her their lives. In the end, everybody drank. You know, that is the rowdiest funeral since, uh, well, since ever. <laughs> Feels like she would have liked that. Yeah, damn straight. Damn straight. <laughs> she would have put them all under the table. I've seen hearing them for the past couple of days, which makes me happy, but at the same time, it means the warmer temperature is coming. Yes, definitely. What do you know about the embassy? Lots of birds here chirping too. Only that Avad really wants it to happen. He said, I'm making peace with these 
to knock. Them. But from what I hear, they're not too big on the whole diplomacy thing. They do most of their talking with blades and arrows. So if you're heading their way, be prepared. Things might get ugly real fast. I'll keep that in mind. What do you know about this place? Well, nothing good. It's where the cards you dragged all the captives they took from the Forbidden West during the Red Raids. Lucky ones became slave labor. The rest were hauled off to the Sun Ring and Meridian. Your sacrifice. You got it. Tanakh made sure to wreck the place before they chased the Karja out of the West. I can't say I blame them. And now Avad's paying the Osram to rebuild it. And no matter how much new stone they put up, it'll still be stained in blood. Oh, Aaron, I hope you're gonna I forgive go. me. Oh, yeah, don't let me stop you. Just, are you, are you sure about this? Yeah, I'm saving the world. That's, that sounds like a lot for just one. Aaron. Yeah, all right. Can't blame me for trying. I, I guess what I'm really trying to say is if you ever do need me, I know where to find you. Hopefully sober next time. Yeah, don't count on it. Be careful out there, Aloy. Let's see. Nice no name, thank you. Frank is also kind of nice. Have slashed him. Kind of sketchy. Should be easy if to I would blood trail with my focus. just want to be funny, I would give, give her some Hungarian very old school traditional names wait what looks like they're headed for that bridge gotta loot the stuff down there I don't know why, but whenever someone asks me to name something, my brain immediately goes to Dave. <laughs> yeah, my naming in Sadu Valley is absolutely top tier. Like, I forgot to disable the... Um, the automatic... Bird. For my sheep. And I just... I thought I disabled. Really? And out of a sudden, one morning I woke up and it's like... Oh, you just had a new baby sheep. And I was like, what the heck? So I named the sheep Surprise. Everything's called here. Personally, I don't play with those games. But I'm interested in No Man's Sky. Out of here. Oh boy. This pigment will work well in armor. This looks like a good place for someone to hide. Whoa, look at them cars. I tried to to give them names but after a while I gave up. Like I am I, I got another surprise um animal and I named that surprise too, so I don't know. <laughs> oh Oh I can open these. Okay. Yes, I forgot that I can do that. I called my chicken chickadee and chickadee, so I don't know what to tell you. Very original. Oh. I do you hear you guys? If we give up now, we have to find 
In his shadow, we will find strength. I say we kill the lot. And take on a whole garrison. It won't be easy. We don't know Larvik's dead. He hasn't shown at the rendezvous point. So either that fool guard killed him, or he's lost his nerve. We'll just have to the blast traitor. our way through the gates. And then what? Rayad was our only link to Vezra. And now he's dead too. We'll track Vezra if we have to. But first we have to get past Baron Light. Next change of guard we go in fast and loud. Conover was right. I have to stop them before they hurt anyone else. A bar will suffer. That will be good. That's the only stuff I'm gonna be able to do. I think the others will notice me after this. but then it usually I'm like oh yeah let's try to sneak around and I I'm getting seen like right after the first blow but thank you I'm trying <laughs> it certainly has that I started to play this game right after I finished Zero Dome good night Pay back every carger that turned code on us. Do you have a path that you're moving? I need to move when that guy is not watching. Avad will suffer. And that will be a good day. Oh, he's coming back. We are stealth, yes. Oh, dude. Soon we will march on the east, and all will fall. Good night. He's on turn. Oh, there are more there? Yes. I'm trying to be patient. Maybe he doesn't see inside, probably. Okay, bro, move. <gasps> Over there. Thank it. There we go. No more hiding. No. I knew that I'm gonna mess it up. Takes care of that. Where's the other one? Sure, there's more of them outside. I better be careful. Well, that's loot. Oh, yeah, there are more there. Oh, he has a mask. Oh, no. And I don't have any more ammo. Ah, this button. Well, he will come here anyway. Yes, yes. I'm not afraid of you, bro. Wait, that's not. That's cheating. I don't have a bomb ammo yet.
you can you die already please See, I don't like close range fights because I'm very bad at close range fights, so I prefer to fight. That. It seems um, like there's more eclipse beyond the daunt. If this Rayad was their only link to them, he might have a focus. It could tell me where they are. Yeah. So I, I really prefer just being far away as possible from them. Because I'm not very good at fighting, you know. I like our trades, so... Alrighty, what do we have here? must have been his. I was right. Ryad has a focus. Ay ay ay. Loyal Eclipse. If you're seeing this, so guess the trap done and long is as as I yeah. yeah. Something to follow. Your journey is almost over. Follow the sun beyond the gates of barren light. And bask in the gloom of future conquest. A new empire awaits. Oh, I have to yeah, these... And crush his new eclipse empire before it begins. There's coordinates here. Not past barren light. Ryad's mask should be enough to prove Conover's innocence. I better take it back to Baron Light. Okay. I do like that you have more options in this game, though. Oh my god! <laughs> okay. Look alive, soldier. Uh, She's back. Aloy! Did you find anything? Feel free Eclipse to give these fugitives were camped on the other side of the forest. These are some cookies to each other. And they were getting ready to fight their way through Baron Light. You just helped save a lot of lives. Aloy, you know I believe you. Oh, I but did. Nazar, I'm okay. Thank you, Raven. He might not even. be convinced by your words alone. If he needs proof, show him that. And tell him the man he's got locked up. It was just that I had a meeting to from an five an spy. to six. Huh. I guess you are his savior. Oh, so I was like, and I didn't soldier, have time to take them out, out before, before that. I'll make sure this gets to Nozar. That's it then. The end of the eclipse. Slice of strawberry cakes. Let's go. The trespassers you mentioned, the ones who got through Baron Light weeks ago. Their leader. Yeah, dangerous. this is what you get when you and work for in the Forbidden West. Global company building up an army. <laughs> Sun and Shadow, you're going out there to stop them, aren't you? I'm gonna try. I want to help. I can fight. I know you can. But you've been through a lot. Once you're out of that cell, you should enjoy your freedom. You've earned it. Take them out, Savior. Oh, Ivy, don't worry about that. Take them. Lighten up, Ivy. You've got a thick wall of stone between you and the Tanakh up there. Yes, sir. Why the long face, my boss? The armor looks there? so good. No, I sir. love the purple. Are you in charge around here? What a surprise. Ah, apologies. No, that would be Commander Nozar. I'm Lawan, the second in command. So, I want some cake, but all I got is a single chocolate Light. thing. I'm here for the embassy. I, oh, I would die for some chocolate. So I can head west. And maybe now that Studious Wadis is here, we can finally get things underway. <laughs> yes, the Sun Priest. Walked in practically kicking and screaming behind his escort. Really seems to like his scrolls. But the embassy remains delayed. Commander Nozar has signaled our readiness, but the Tanakh Marshals have yet to sound their horn. <sighs> All right, fine. Let me through the gates then. I have my own business with them. I'm sure Apple you do. Pie. I'm Let's afraid go. I can't. Commander's orders. 
Normally, the gates are open for any who dare to venture out. <laughs> Us around Salvager, it just sounds like he has tons of sugar. But no one's allowed in or out before an embassy. Which I'm fine with. I would also like Once to... Once the but Tanakh have left. One day, I will try to make an apple pie, but like... It's best when you... It's, it's just like you... Took it out from the oven, sprinkled it with a little bit of powdered sugar, and it's still warm. I swear, that's one of the best things. So what happens at these embassies, exactly? Yeah, it's very sugar heavy. The Karja offer tribute of food, spices, and gear. In exchange, the Tanath return personal effects taken from Karja oh, I want soldiers apple pie that too. fell during the Red Raids. I want pizza, I want this apple pie. Embassy, however, is a special case because the Tanakh they're handing over some sort of prisoner right a soldier named Fashav ah so you've heard the exchange has got everyone on edge you never An know apple pie pizza you well know practically over. no 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 where is this commander Nozar then if he's the one keeping the gates shut I'll convince him to open them for me I'll take you to him, but I have to warn you. The commander isn't one to break protocol, especially when he's already high strung. We'll see about that. This way. There's a lot of activity going on around here. The Tanakh tore down this place during the Red Raids. Two years of labor, and we still have a long way to go. The work sure to with this when the pineapple pizza face like, yeah. But I hear a certain Nora got them back to work. I was just helping out. I agree, yes, well, I'm even. sure Alvin was thrilled. Of course you and me to leave. No, don't even try. No, stop it. Stand aside, soldier. Sir. There's the commander. Better brace yourself. And good luck. Pizza crunch? No, actually. How are we to hold an embassy with a tribe that can't even govern their own people? What more can you expect from barbarians? Ahem. <clears throat> ah. Aloy, was it? Yes. The one who cleared the valley for you? That Aloy. <laughs> we appreciate your service. At least we are ready for the embassy to begin. Didn't you just give the signal? Both sides must signal readiness. Until the Tanakh sound their horn, we wait. Yea, for as the first shall be... Oh, please stop, up. buddies. Why yeah, let's I... go, Aloy! <laughs> the Tanakh are a tribe composed of three clans. <laughs> How many banners do you see? You're just gonna wait? Go find out what's wrong. <sighs> oh, this isn't some forgotten corner of the east where you come from, Nora. It's the Forbidden West. I can go there. If you don't like it, run back to Meridian. File a complaint. The Meridian I saved, you mean? That's right. Nobody walks to the gate until the third clan arrives and the Tanakh horn has sounded. Not even the savior of Meridian. Oh, watch me, dude. Oh, I want to go. Let me catch up with you. But without pizza toppings, you just switch the dough. I think it would be good. In Scotland, you can go into the fish and chip shop and ask for it. Deep fried pizza. They also do the deep fried morse bars in Scotland, if I remember right. I want to try one. You can, yes, it's more of a tourist thing to ask for. I never had it personally. Oh my god. Okay. I mean, I've never been to um, Scotland. So, I don't know, but if I go, I will try it out for sure. But I don't have any more quests to do, like, I don't want to wait. Well, thanks, but I've waited long enough. It's time to go. Absolutely not. This embassy depends on diligent adherence to... You shall not! Keep you shall that. not pass! I uh, just watch me, dude. Oh, the dude! Oh, word! And he shaved. 
That's gonna be unpleasant. Well, hello! Open the gates, please. Feel like it can stay spent. Let her through that gate! That is a direct order! Sorry, can't do it. I'm asking nicely. I would try it, maybe I will ask for it next time. <laughs> Let's go, please let us know how it was. I'm curious. What's happening? I you know the usual Aloy wants something, people Open try to stand in her way. It's not gonna work. Oh, that's it. Arrest her. I'd like to see you try. Supporting fire? Yeah, I'm locked and loaded. Hey, nose off. You stupid. I love bitch. these two. You think you got the authority to keep that door shut in the savior of Meridian's face? What, what so do you think? Can taste but look, I think my pizza can make it make sense. He hears what you Miss Scott's don't live on a diet you? of Haggis, deep fried Mars bars and Inbrew. I just had a cold glass of Inbrew after work. <laughs> Hello, Ariel. Saving the world. Don't forget about whiskey, right? Forget something back in Meridian? <sighs> look, Burl. It doesn't matter. Made it just in time. Warl is way too apologetic. Not apologetic, sorry, forgiving. So this tribe what is Marat English? Told us about the Tanakh. We need their permission to go west. Yeah, well, I figured it'd be nice if they weren't trying to kill me the whole time. But this embassy hasn't started yet. We're just gonna barge in. Just no more politics. No more delays. Oh well. Now at least you have some backup. I guess I'll oh, do it. We'll see how it goes. I love you, but I have a feeling you're gonna die. It takes a lot to make chocolate taste bad. I mean, I'm pretty sure I can. I can achieve that. That is the line between east and west. Cross it and die. Hold on now. Let's take it easy. None may walk this valley until our signal sounds. That was our accord with the Karja. Well, I'm not a Karja. I came there we on go. My own to ask for right of passage. But they opened the gate for you, did they not? What is the meaning of this violation? Why send a child? Do they want to parley or not? The Karja can't be trusted. This is no. Forget the Karja. This has nothing to do with them. I need to go west to save lives. Maybe even yours. The only lives you can save are your own. By turning back. Now. Hold. Oh? She's telling the truth about one thing. She's not Karja. She's a Nora from the Savage East. And if she seeks to save lives, should we not listen? Let me speak to her. One last favor for a fellow marshal before he's taken away. Taken away? Wait, what? Okay. Um. The umber tastes like bubblegum to me. It's good. Really? I, I, don't, I don't know if I, I never heard of it. A fearless red-headed Nora. Your fruit opinions are now in the so called savior of Maria. People say it tastes like that, Just but I don't know. I probably tasted I am in Brew long before I ever. Once of the Karja High Bubba Command, Girl. last of the army of the setting sun. You're for I want to try all of these things. Vod gave now. me a message for you. That he waits for you in Meridian where you belong. Hmm. <laughs> Avad always was polite. Well, now I'm even more curious about you knowing that you have the confidence of the Sun King. But such an association with the Karja could work against you here, as it often has with me. As you can see, tensions are high. This embassy is a delicate affair. They're about to return me to the Sundom, a gesture that might help soothe painful grievances. And now you arrive, unheralded. I'm not here to cause trouble. I just need to go west. So you say. I might be able to help. This game on a city looks amazing visually. I, I remember it large at an awkward time if I recall correctly. Along with some assurance that I won't regret it. 
So, um, we don't have Imbro in Europe. We need to bribe Ben into shipping us some ES leave. Definitely. We should bribe him. Because I want to try all these things. And I don't... Like, I had never been even to the UK, but now I want to go to UK and Scotland. Because, like, if I'm there, like, you know... I want to try all of these things, but I don't even know when it could happen. But I'd love to. But, um... Yeah, so... I real I think the first game launched at an awkward time. Someone told me the story behind it, but I think it launched with another high profile game. And it didn't get a lot of attention because of that, which is a shame if you ask me. Um because I really love the first game. And um some unreasonable people doesn't like the fact that Aloy doesn't have makeup, like super like all over the way makeup, which is like BS, like especially in this world, like I just find it a very stupid argument and that she's not like conventionally beautiful, which I'm like, what are you talking about? Look at her! Like, what do you mean she's not? Like, she's so pretty. Like, are you blind? Whatever. I'm. I have my own arguments about that. How did you, know. you come to be among the Tanakhs? It's quite a story, but not a quick one. But they no, improved a lot on the facial expressions in this game. Are you sure you want to hear it? I guess we have time. Very well. I marched with Sun King Jaran's raiders when they came west, hoping to moderate their worst impulses. I failed, of course. They committed unspeakable atrocities, stirring the Tanakh into action. When the clans overran our forward encampment at Cinnabar Sands, I stayed behind to help the last stragglers evacuate. I was taken prisoner. I didn't make it easy for my captors, mind you. And they paid me back in kind on the journey to their capital. I lost so much blood on the way that I was white as a corpse when they threw me before Chief Akaro. I thought I was dead for sure, so I resorted to desperate measures. Make sure he gets you the 19... Zero one old and unimproved version, the one they bought out after the UK sugar tax. Sucks. Hmm. Yeah, the first one launched two days before. Yeah, Breath of the Wild. Yes. Yes. And the second one launched a week before Eldering, so a tough crowd. Indeed. Yeah. Yeah. Indeed. Don't tell you, I also heard about alcoholic version, so I want to try that as well. Oh wow, they both launched at an awkward time. Indeed. And I think. This game needs more attention, to be honest. So when you met the Tanakh chief, you did something Because it's really no, detailed word. Open as the if you take time along, to... And I heard mutterings about a kind of trial by combat that they revere. So, when they flung me at Hakaro's feet, I demanded this right, called the Kurut. Thinking that by winning, I could request a boon. My life, or even my freedom. The other Tanakh howled, but Hakaro stared them down. And then his gaze fell upon me. Evidently, he appreciated my ingenuity. He allowed me to participate in the cool route. Little did I know what I was in for. You said the cool route is a Tanakh trial by combat. Yes. But it is no ordinary trial. It doesn't pit men against each other, at least not directly. Instead, the combatants fight machines in a great arena, and only the strongest survive. Believe me, it is no easy thing to stare down a charging machine while hundreds around you scream for blood. Tell me about it. About that than you might think. Yeah, we just experienced that in the Sun Ring. Well, then you have my respect. Like you, I lived through it to claim my prize. I had hopes for freedom, but well, that wasn't on offer. Only service to the chief. 
But yeah, a lot of gross dudes on the internet drag on this game for unsavory reasons. Yeah, I agree, I agree. A colleague in bro, it won't be by bars. I will bet it will be some other versions of Inbrew. Might still taste alright though. I heard the first one as they offered it for free on PlayStation during lockdown. They took and ran to playing it. Yes, yeah, definitely do. It's so detailed, like, and I definitely recommend really just immersing yourself in it. Do all the quests. Because it, it does add to the story and to Aloy's character. You wound up serving the Tanakh chief. The winners of the cool route must serve the chief as his marshals. You mentioned that word before. What does it mean? Well, the word itself refers to a kind of protective spirit from the ancient past. In practice, marshals are Hikaru's roving lawgivers. Part magistrate, part judge, part executioner. I won my place among their ranks and served as honor demanded, but many Tanakh still spat on the ground when I walked by. But they did, until I started forcing them to the ground to grind their faces in it. I guess yeah, that's one okay. way to deal with it. As you may have noticed, violence is the native tongue of the Tanakh. To survive, one must master it. The truth is, though, the Karja speak it too. More than they should. I can't blame the Tanakh for hating them. So then, are you still Karja? Part of me, yes. Always. Yet there is much to admire about the Tanakh, especially their chief. Now, I've heard stories the chief about what now? it was like before his reign. Three clans always at war, constantly slitting each other's throats. Hikaru and the marshals have crafted a delicate peace, and now he looks to the future. Who knows? Maybe that future will include cooperation with the Karja. The Karja talk about Hikaru as if he's a monster. The Karja feel compelled to demonize him if only because he swept them from the field. It is true that he is fearsome. When I was first taken before him, I thought he would flay me alive. But he is no bloodthirsty tyrant like the Mad Sun King was. I think that if you were fortunate enough to meet him, as I was, you would find that he only wants the best for his people. I hope you do speak to him. I'm sure you'd interest him. Oh, another person so, who falls in love? That's my story. Aloy? You're the first Easterner to hear it. But not the last. The Karja need to know what I have learned. Yeah. The way you talk about the Tanakh is a lot different than how they do. I think he said it tastes very similar to regular in brew, so it might be good. Why did I go look up what heck is this? I've lost my appetite. <laughs> I don't want to know. I've never then. <laughs> seen markings like those on a Karja before. The Karja see ink as decoration. For the Tanakh, it is much more. A litany of deeds. A record of vanquished enemies. Looks like you vanquished quite a few. I've fought my share of battles. Oh, can I have tattoos too? But I feel that my life... Like my markings, is only half complete. Yeah, I wouldn't recommend looking up. I won't. Shows my I won't. Deeds. Before I die, I'd like to see the other half marked with the laurels of peace. Are you glad to be going back to Meridian? Oh, I'll admit that I wouldn't mind sleeping in a feather bed or sipping wine from the southern vineyards. But I have another goal in mind. As someone who knows the Tanakh and the Karja, I'm in a unique position to advocate for both. If Sun King Avad is amenable, my hope is to establish a lasting peace. The Tanakhs don't seem that peaceful. They're not, as a rule. But these are difficult times. Chief Akaro knows that survival often requires change, even if that change means putting aside centuries of war. Hey. You asked why I need rite of passage. I'll tell you, but you won't like my answer. Six months ago, the world almost ended in Meridian. That threat still exists. It's getting worse every day, much worse. Calling down storms, poisoning the water, 
enraging the machines. The source of it all has gone west, and I'm the only one who can stop it. I've seen the signs, and I've heard tales of incredible occurrences in Meridian, an army of demons vanquished by a red-haired champion. Mm -hmm. So I'm inclined to believe you. The burden of your task is written across your face clearer than any mark of mine. I'll grant you this, to serve as proof of your right to travel into Tanakh lands. A task so important, and it's just the two of you. Take it from one who aspires to be a diplomat. Allies are essential. Chief Akaro knows the West better than anyone. He may be able to help you. He can be intimidating to others, but don't let that deceive you. He is a man of his word. Maybe. If I need him. Your choice. I want to meet him. I'm you can intrigued. Find him at his palace, past the mountains to the southwest. Tell him I sent you. And he'll listen to Look! The Sky Clan's banner. Oh, they're nice and purplish reddish. Marshals. It wasn't easy, but I brought the Sky Clan with me. And the commander? Uh, no. I could only convince a few. He isn't yet aware we left. We have banners from all three clans. If there are fewer from the Sky Clan, it can't be helped. He's right. Sound the horn. What's going on? Not all Tanakh can stomach the idea of parlay with the Kaja. But enough have come for us to begin. Then I'll be on my way. No. The other marshals will not permit it. You wanted safe passage, you have it. After the embassy. Why war skin look a bit blue? The Karja have opened the gates. As the sun rises over a land at war, so too can it set over a land at peace. Today is such. What? Hear me, marshals! You who claim to be Tanakh! Oh no, I sniff bad Chief things. Akaro's biggest mistake a rival whom he should have killed. You have forgotten that our people were born in blood. The blood of the Karja. She looks kind of cool. Instead, you pledge your spears to a chief who conspires with the enemy. Hikaru has betrayed us. The embassy is proof. And all of you marshals are his accomplices. For this, I condemn you to death. You'll need more the blood than threats to intimidate us. Exile. Oh no. Cute dinosaur thing. Lancers. Oh no, okay. Oh my god. Riding machines. Where'd they learn to do that? Silence. Vashav, come with us now, or not at all. Archers, light them up. Oh boy, this is not gonna end well. Get to cover! Like, why are you even standing in one place? Dude, is this the place where Wara's gonna die? No, no, just stay. Archers, keep them back. Eloy, do something. 
Oh, the frame rate of this is killing me. Oh boy. They're not gonna make it. Especially that they don't even have weapons. Oh no, they're not gonna open the gates. He's dead. Oh well. Oh, goodbye. this guy he was a dig but I kind of liked him he was honest <gasps> no no not this one no you're like you know you're just standing there and watching what is wrong with you Girl, to cover. Archers on the ridge. Okay, so where are they coming from? Here they come. They're on to us. Where am I blind? Yes, I am actually blind. One down. Don't worry about it. Whoop. Big binding games in an universe of singles. <laughs> yes, it is. He is strong. Oh no, 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 no. Guys, you gotta live. Oh god dang it. This is a mess. This is a huge mess. Um. Oops. 
Do I even have stuff to cut this? Yes. Ha ha ha. Oh boy. What the hell is a weapon? He looks pretty cool. He got bitched up. <laughs> I'm sorry. Please don't die, War. You're next, girl. I've never seen a shield like that. Better scan it. Bro, he is fast. Give it up. Whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, no, I'm pressing the wrong button. He's so fast. Ha! There you go. This is. Oh my god, I was about to say this is very easy, but. Bro, I'm trying to archer you down. Dead. Oh. Don't jinx it. Yeah, I I kind of did. Thank you, Silence, for messing things up here. <gasps> His arm! Oh my god! You gonna make it? You're going on without me, aren't you? Because I'm stuck with Aaron. For now. Oh. Come on. Uh. I'll take you back to the fort. Uh. Oh, not that guy. I actually liked him. Uh. 
I got you. Okay, this was going very badly. I didn't expect anything good, but I also didn't expect that everyone is gonna be initially butchered. It's salvage time, boys. You... Oh... sort out this mess. Seems like the Tanakh have a civil war in their hands. That sounds about right. The marshals weren't expecting Regala to attack. And the entire Karja delegation was slain. Nozar, Vwadis, Peshav. A massacre. What will you do now? I have to head west. Hopefully this rite of passage is still good. For what I'm after, I'll cross all of Tanakh's territory if I have to. Then you have a long road ahead of you. This is only the threshold of the Forbidden West. The Tanakh's true domain lies over the mountains that border Plainsong, home of the Utaru tribe. This isn't Tanakh's territory? All that out there? That's no man's land. It was supposed to be neutral ground, though... Obviously, this Regala ignored that. Indeed. Her approached from the north, with all those machines they were riding. They must have made camp up that way. The rebels were riding bristlebacks. And there were bristlebacks in the Daunt. Are you saying the rebels let them into the Daunt? How would that even be possible? I don't know. But it's worth looking into. While you're at it, there were a number of Karja and Asuram who went out there before the gates were shut for the embassy. Maybe you could check in on them. See if they're all right. I can keep an eye out. Is there a tall neck somewhere nearby? A tall neck? There's that one, over there, near the Utara border. But why... It's tall neck! Uh, our best it's hard friend! to explain. It'll help me get the lay of the land. If you say so. Is there anything else I can tell you before you go? Do you think the Karja will take action against Regala? Seems like you'd have common ground with the Tanakhs. An expedition of the Karja army into the west could be taken as the start of another invasion. Sun King Avad won't risk it. That said, we can't allow ourselves to be caught unaware by an attack like that again. Fashav called Regala a rival. Someone the Tanakhs chief should have killed. <laughs> yeah, I reckon he should have. She's obviously a huge threat. Her attack was coordinated and precise. Until you got in her way, that is. Mm. They knew the I'm way good at that. And they knew Fashav was going to be handed over at the embassy. If the Tanakhs weren't expecting her, she must have spent months gathering an army in secret. They had to have made camp nearby. Somewhere they could lie low until the perfect moment to strike. Yeah, I'm time to, to go. My way. Then I wish you luck. The gates will always be open to you should you wish to return. And don't worry about your friends. We'll get them patched up. I appreciate it. Sun, watch over you, Aloy. I hope you find what you're looking for. Survive the ambush at the embassy and gain passage into. Yes, yes, yes. Lots of loot here. Which I won't leave. 
va être sessionné, je, je, je... I see, okay, that's gonna be cool. Watch me die like a hundred times. So, this is the Forbidden West. A whole new frontier to explore. The coordinates from the spire should lead to silence in Hades. And just maybe, the backup of Gaia. It won't be easy out there. The blight, the storms, Regala's machine writers. But I'll have to push through it all. Find a way to fix the world. Like Elizabeth would. <laughs> <laughs> 